Once upon a time, there was a ship named Theseus. Obviously, it was made of different materials, like wooden planks, nails, ropes, and etc. After many years, the sailor noticed the wood started to rot. He decided to replace them one by one. After two years, some nails here and ropes there, little by little, all the parts of the ship had been replaced. In the meanwhile, the port official decided to put all the parts of the ship in a special warehouse instead of throwing it away, since they weren't completely worn out. One day, after a few months, the port faced financial difficulties. Therefore, the manager decided to use again the materials in order to build a new ship. Since Theseus was one of the best ships in the port, he decides to build the new ship exactly like it. He recreated the exact same shape like Theseus from the same original materials it was built from. So now the port has two ships that look exactly the same. And now the question arises, which one is the real Theseus? The current ship with all of its parts that were slowly replaced, or the new ship that was recreated in the same shape and from the materials that the original Theseus was built of? This is a thought experiment about whether an object that has had all of its original parts replaced remains the same object. The English philosopher John Locke offered a different version of this experience, and it goes something like this. His favorite socks had a hole in them, and so he darned it with extra fabric. After a few months, they were torn again from a different place, and so he darned it again. He wondered, do the socks remain the same socks when all the original fabric is gone? When it's been replaced by pieces of other fabric, designed to close the holes that have been opened over the years? Are these the same socks? Let me know what you think and why in the comments.